Thank you. Hello everybody, my name is Craig Bennett and today I am answering a quick question with a somewhat quick answer for Android coding. And basically this question comes in and, and, and I, I want to get into something real quick before I actually get in, into the question. I um, This is the first time I got a complex question like this and um, if you're going to send me a question kind of like this where it has to you have to put out some code or you think you might have to then make sure you save the stuff to your github and then just link me the project and that way i can take a look at it in its full glory because um one and this is pretty important one what can happen is you might think okay this information is cool and whatever and i i don't you know it, it might not be working because you got the wrong id or whatever um you know so so what you think's relevant may not be or it could be but it's a little bit easier for me to um to do that um let's see beyond that uh, if it's like a simple question like how do you make it on click listener or something like that or how do you make a button then that's that's pretty easy and I, I can throw it up but even answering something like this gets very complex and i gotta get into a video like this and i don't have a problem with that but it it's easier to go through github so uh as far as that goes basically the person what they want to do is um is have a button that changes the background and the background color and um, every time the buttons clicked it's cool so basically I got a basic setup um, I'm not gonna run it to through emulator or whatever uh, but basically you have a button you click it and it changes the background how's that happen where well, I'm assuming that if you're watching this then you pretty much know the basics the uh, ID and whatnot but basically what you need to do is say when the buttons click you need to go and and get the method so to get color method I have it in a different class and to get color method basically it's a random number generator it pulls out from that list and it says okay this is the one that sends it over so and it returns as a integer but um, basically it pulls from the list and sends it over and says uh, get the thing from that method uh, and then down here it says set the color to that so set the text color or set the background color to that so what you would need to do the, the person what they're trying to do is um, pulling over is uh they were trying to put it all in xml which i understand where that was going um but really you need to use something like this where it's a class because w w what's happening is is it, it gives you a little bit more functionality it's actually slightly easier unless if you're doing a very static thing so uh I think they wanted a random, yeah, uh, changes the background every time, yeah. So they wanted a random, and the only way to really do this is to go through a class. If you wanted to do a static, you can use a um, a, a, a uh, XML file, which is fine. You just got to pull from it. But uh, what we're doing here is we're just going through a uh, class and say, here's a RAM number generator, spit out one of the following, send it over here, and, and then it says change the color of that to, to that, and it'll change the background. And also the text color. Um, I, I didn't change the, I, I didn't add that into here by the way so in case you were wondering but I figured um, having you know a button I'll add the other stuff later having having a button will answer your question right there 
but anyways as far as that goes if you got any questions or anything else then feel free to let me know and i'll try to answer as quickly as possible and um again if you got a little bit more complex make sure you have it on github and and that way just like link it over and and i'll, I'll take a look at it on github don't use shorteners by the way i don't click on shorteners um there, there's no reason to use uh, link shorteners on here but uh, as far as that goes uh, have a good day subscribe check out the patreon yada yada